Representatives from various military branches, as well as representatives from CAL FIRE and West Coast City and State officials, met for the two-day Defense Support of Civil Authorities Open House in San Diego, April 28th through 29th. We as the uh, Navy Marine Corps team are, you know, are here to be forward deployed and fight the country's wars. But if called upon, if the President or obviously the Secretary of Defense determines us to uh, support the homeland, uh, it's important that we're able to respond, uh, whether to save lives or, or help the uh, civilian authorities during time of crisis. This is the beginning of a relationship. This is the beginning of a partnership. It's very hard to do things when you call a dude during a crisis. But once we establish these relationships and we surge trust, because you can surge trust, then once it's time to go do mission, we can execute that mission very seamlessly. The open house took place at three of the San Diego naval bases and included a ship tour, static equipment displays, and live demonstrations of the vehicles that would be used for Continental Humanitarian Assistance and Disaster Relief, or HADR, operation. You look out here, you see a lot of the equipment, you see a lot of machinery and whatnot. But the story here is about the Marines and the sailors, because without them, this would not be possible. When you talk to them, you can sense this pride and professionalism and not just what they do, but who they are. And this is what our military is about. Not just going overseas and fighting battles, not just providing HADR offshore and overseas, but it's about here, right here in the United States, in support of our Americans when they are in need of our services and our support. From San Diego, California, I'm Petty Officer Brian Jackson.